Hello YouTube, my name is Pamela Ware and today I am going back into my kitchen because I don't know about you but I have so much meat in my freezer and I need to cook it so I took out a whole chicken so I'm gonna roast the chicken so it's always good to preheat your oven beforehand so that it is ready and warm when it comes time to cook the chicken so now I preheated it at 300 degrees all right so for my roasted chicken I'll be using a whole chicken some potatoes, some onions, some carrots, some olive oil, oregano, cumin, paprika, garlic powder, onion powder, and some cayenne pepper. Things first, I am going to peel the potatoes, chop them, peel the onions, chop them, and peel the carrots. All right, so now that I peeled and cleaned all of the vegetables, I'm going to chop them, but it's very important to keep them in big chunks, if not in like the oven. It's gonna cook for three hours, so if you cook it in small chunks, it's gonna get way too soft, so keep big chunks. Oh my God, I hate cutting onions. Am I the only one that's super sensitive to cutting onions? Whew. <laughs> All right, so I'm going to put the potatoes at the bottom of my pan, pot, my pot, and just leave them there. And we're gonna set the pot aside and put the spices on top of the chicken. The potatoes in the bottom. It's going to allow the chicken not to stick to the bottom as well, so that's great. Take all of the spices that you're going to put on the chicken, put them in a bowl, and mix them all together. Now we're going to take the chicken, spread some olive oil all over it, and then rub it all around. This is just to make sure that the spices stick to the chicken when I put them on. We're going to make sure that it gets everywhere so we can have spices. All right, so I had to put in a little work, but I got the pot to close. It was way too full. Um, so I just took out a bit of potatoes. I know it fits. So like I said, I preheated the oven at 300 and we're just gonna pop it in there for about three hours. It's like a slow cook, you know, it's gonna be so good. Okay, so my chicken has been in the oven for three hours. So we're gonna check and see if it's ready. weird but it's gonna be so good this is my meal mm -hmm. so I just finished my dinner and oh my god that chicken was so juicy and amazing and the potatoes were to die for and the carrots mm, perfectly cooked so you guys need to try this recipe because it was delicious Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed my video. Please try this recipe and let me know what you think in the comments. Like, subscribe, and be safe.